All right, today, me and Chiana and I on the Mike Pintech Show, noon to three, and it's all open talk. Big story that I want your opinion on, and we're going to be talking about, you know, I told you about this last night from the Home Office. Republicans on the House Intelligence Committee reached an opposite conclusion yesterday from the intelligence community that they oversee, announcing that Russian President Vladimir Putin was not trying to help Donald Trump win the 2016 election. The Republicans also said they found no evidence that the Trump campaign colluded with Russia and that they are shutting down their year-long investigation. So now what? As I've been saying, a lot of smoke and mirrors, but nothing as of anything that should be even making us think, well, obstruction of justice. So why is it that we have spent all this time, energy and money, when even those who are a lot closer to the story, like I've been saying for the longest time, this Russian story is pretty much nothing. So why can't we just move on and get back to what the president has been talking about, creating a better economy? And I'm also wondering what will be next, because just about every time that you see one of these stories swept away, they sweep another one in. I think it's time for everybody, Democrats and Republicans in the nation's capital, to say, look, this guy's the president, and he's going to be around for a while, so let's try to work with him, because one thing is for sure about President Trump, and that's why this special election today between the Republican Rick Saccone and Democrat Connor Lamb is so important. He is all about jobs first, jobs last. Mike Pintech Show, noon to three with me, Rob Pratt, on KDK Radio. Good afternoon.